take a look at this problem. Given test scores are normally distributed with mean of 80. And a standard deviation of 5. Convert the following x intervals to z intervals. So A, we got x is greater than 72. And B, we got x is less than 91. And C, we got 80 is less than x is less than 90. Okay. Well, um, how we're going to switch this is using our formula for z, which is equal to our x value minus mu over sigma. Now, the x value I'm referring to is a 72. So that's 72 minus mu, which is 80, over sigma, which is 5. 72 minus 80 is negative 8 over 5. So let's see what that gives us. Negative 8 this. negative 1.6 so this x is greater than becomes z is greater than negative 1.6 and all together no spaces now do the same thing with the 91 again we're going to use the formula z is equal to x minus mu over sigma x is 91 minus mu which is 80 over sigma which is 5 91 minus 80 is 11 over 5, which I think is 2.2, but let's see. 11 divided by 5, 2.2. So the x is less than 91 becomes z is less than 2.2. And that's our answer. Now for this one, we're going to have to do this formula twice. So for 80, and we'll also have to do it for 90. So we've got z is equal to x minus mu over sigma. So we're going to have 80 minus 80 over 5, which is sigma. 80 minus 80 is 0. 0 divided by 5 is 0. Now for this one, we'll do the same thing. Plug it into x minus mu over sigma. So we're going to have 90 minus 80 over 5. 90 minus 80 is 10 over 5, or it gives us 2. So the 80 is less than x is less than 90 becomes 0 is less than z is less than 2. And those would be our answers.